Today we're going to put on a new melody string on my hurdy gurdy. Just as you wouldn't simply change the medication your doctor gave you, you also want to make sure that you always talk to your hurdy gurdy maker if you want to put a different kind of string on your instrument. Small changes to the diameter or the tension can change the whole instrument and make it either well playable or maybe even not playable at all. So here's the video! First of all, make sure you're not wearing any belt or putting it somewhere where it gets scratched. I will be using a violin A string to replace my current low quality one. I only have this on because my actual one broke. And no, I am not sponsored. Now I'm loosening the string at the pecs. Well, in my case, I have mechanicals, like on an electric guitar. At the other end of the string, I had a little flat, square-shaped piece of plastic that I will reuse so that the metal end of the string doesn't damage the wood or slip through. Take off the string, get the new string, put that little piece on the new string and attach the string to the one side of the instrument. Now you can see a little tube on the new string. We'll get to that later. For now, I will just be using a piece of paper to prevent the thin string to cut into the melody bridge. Place the piece of paper in a way so that it doesn't touch the vibrating part of the string. Oops! Well, maybe only place it there as soon as the string is halfway tied. <laughs> Alright, got it! So, place it again <laughs> and make sure the string sits on the instrument correctly. Uh, no, please do not immediately tighten the string. First make sure you're giving it a little extra length to wind it up. That gives it more stability and less risk to slip back again. When you're done, you can cut off the spare colored piece of the string. But uh, if you're too lazy, you will just leave it on. <laughs> not that I would ever leave this on. <laughs> now it's time to tune up and put cotton on the string. In my case, I also put new rosin on the wheel. Tune every now and then, since the string will need some hours to settle. Now try different heights of the melody bridge to get used to it. Done! That was not even that different than changing the strings of an electric guitar, right? If you're interested in seeing how to change a trumpet string or a drone string or a sympathetic string, then leave me a comment and I'll see what I can do. I just filmed this now because that was actually the string I had to change and so I just turned on the camera. After I filmed this, I talked to my hurdy-gurdy maker about the little tube that came with the string. I knew not all strings have them, so I wanted to show you another option how to prevent the string from cutting into the bridge. He said the tubes are safe to use for gurdies too, so that's how it looks now. After all, I'm still not completely happy with the sound of the new string, so I'm soon going to try out a string that has a little more tension. Thank you for bearing with me and have a good day. Bye bye. <laughs>